Right now, banning cell phones in schools. This is a debate happening in the Shawnee Mission School District. KMBC 9's Krista Tatchell is joining us live. And Krista, the district wants to get parents involved in all this. They sure do. There is no current cell phone ban in the Shawnee Mission School District. That's why they're putting an online survey for parents. They can fill out and kind of weigh in on this issue. Now, parents who are local and involved in the phone free movement in schools, they say this is a great plan and they are taking a petition to the school board in two weeks to kind of say their give their piece, their side of the issue. Well, we spoke with one of them today. Diana Dewey is part of the phone free movement and she's a Shawnee Mission parent and a substitute teacher in the district. She wrote the petition petition and says data shows kids have over 1,000 interactions with their phone during school hours per day. She says teachers then have to police the phones and um, the opponents to the ban are also mostly parents. They say they want to be able to find their kids quickly in case of emergencies. Dewey says the goal is to ultimately help teachers focus on teaching and kids to focus on their teachers, not screens. It's so unfair to put this burden on the teachers because the kid gets their phone out and you say, put it away, please. And they put it back in their pocket, but then it comes back out. The district says it will wait to comment further until all public opinion has been gathered. Now, I've been communicating with about, about 20 teachers today from Blue Valley, Olathe, Shawnee Mission, and Gardner. And one teacher from Olathe said they've had a cell phone ban for this year for the first time, and her students are more engaged. They seem happier, and they communicate better with their teachers. Well, we'll have more coming up at 6. I'm live in Overland Park. Krista Tatchell, KNBC 9 News. All right. Thank you, Krista. More than 3,000 people have responded to that district on online survey. The phone free schools petition will be presented then to the school board in two weeks.